Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The Tell Me bar in Office appears to the right of the last tab in the ribbon. Alternatively, the Microsoft search bar for Office 365 appears in the middle of the title bar. However, if desired, you can also make it appear as a small magnifying glass button towards the right end of the title bar instead. Both tools let you find help, commands, and content in Word. However, Microsoft Search and its more advanced content search abilities are only available in Office 365 for business plans, and the content it displays is determined by your Office 365 search administrators. Depending on your Office installation, you will usually have one of these tools available for you to use. To use either the Tell Me bar or the Microsoft Search bar in Word, type a search term or terms or phrase for what you want to do into the Tell Me or Search bar. As you type, a drop-down menu then appears below the bar. It shows related actions or commands, command locations, matching words in the document, and help suggestions. If using Microsoft Search, you may also see documents and your Office colleagues appear in your search results depending on the search content allowed by your Office 365 search administrators. You can click the suggested commands or select from the command locations to execute them without needing to find them in the ribbon. You can click the Find in Document link to show matching results in the navigation pane that then appears at the left side of the document as mentioned in a previous lesson. You can select from the Help Topics shown in the side menu that appears when you roll over the Get Help on command to open those topics in the Help pane which is discussed in the next lesson. You can also select the Smart Lookup On command to perform a Smart Lookup on your search term and show the results in the Smart Lookup pane that then opens to the right. We'll examine using the Smart Lookup pane in a later lesson as well. Note that when you initially click into either the Tell Me bar or the Microsoft search bar in Word, a drop-down menu of recently used commands and suggested commands appear in the two sections of the same names. The Recently Used section lists the last few actions you selected, which makes it easier to select them to repeat a function you may often perform. The Suggested section lists commands you may want to select to try using them. If using Microsoft Search in Word, to collapse the bar down to just the magnifying glass icon if desired, click the File tab in the ribbon. Then click the Options command at the left side of the backstage view. In the Word Options dialog box that then opens, select the General command at the left side of the dialog box. Under the User Interface Options section to the right, then check the Collapse the Microsoft Search Box by Default checkbox. Then click the OK button at the bottom of the Word Options dialog box to apply the change. At that point, the Microsoft Search Bar then appears as a magnifying glass icon towards the right end of the title bar. You can click this icon to then show the Microsoft search bar in its usual position. After using it, it then collapses back into the magnifying glass icon again. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.